Hello viewers, I'm SB and welcome back to Darkest Dungeon 2 where today we step into the penultimate area of this run. Could this be? Could we somehow make it through this? I don't know, let's not get too ahead of ourselves. We still got an awful lot of pigs left to fight. But for positive relationships, you know, it feels, feels like a good starting point. So, I don't think we have anything to worry about goal-wise. Win 4 plus road battles will get us a trinket that's, like, fine. Um, we would like for Bonnie to get a bunch of killing blows, but that's pretty likely. Bonnie hits real hard. So, yeah. I guess just go. I mean, I definitely want to tack left and hit the watchtower, I think. We do have a point of... If I do that, we're headed to an oasis afterward. That's pretty nice. We have a point of loathing, which is like a little bit of a thing to worry about. But yeah, I think that's the plan. Left and then the watchtower. Boy, is that the question mark they wanted? Okay, it is. Really, really no way to know. Man. Rough. You must be strong enough to shoulder more than your share of the burden. I mean, I reckon we are. I think we're in an okay spot. Uh, that's a bunch of scouting, which we don't actually need. So we're going to solve that problem. These two just want to bail. <laughs> Well, I mean, so like 30 flame, right? But we have some, we have a light item, don't we? Neither one of these options feels like we're giving them anything. So, so I guess I feel okay about that. Like none of, none of this has anything to do with helping them. I don't feel too I don't feel too evil going this way. And then it's middle path. Consider all variables, but do it quickly. Cool, we get to de-stress Bonnie, who is the one who most needs it. It is bad here. I don't yeah. Oh. Okay. A swarm of bugs hit us so hard that it actually damaged the armor. This is definitely one of the more unpleasant, um, one of the more unpleasant environments. Yo, friends, I don't think that watchtower is going to be of much use. All right. So, what have we? I feel like that thing where it like moves up and reveals everything really like pretty slowly, but not slowly enough for you to actually make use of looking at it is a really strange implementation. Gosh, you know what I didn't realize? <laughs> I didn't look ahead far enough to notice this. Um, post this watchtower, it doesn't matter that we've scouted because we literally never get to make a choice. It is actually just a straight line all the way to the end. Okay, well, I guess it is what it is. So we're gonna endure some more, ugh, we're gonna endure more wheel and uh, armor damage. This is kind of ugly. A sanctum of tranquility awaits. It's true, we do at least get a little bit of tranquility. The And unfortunately, I don't think we're stripping much loathing anytime soon, so... The torch might just go out. An oasis. Alright. Uh, yeah, personal de-stress is definitely less important than get some more of that water. Hell yeah. So let's take a quick look at our inventories here. Who wants to carry around some water? Um, 
maybe we don't equip anyone else with the water. It's just good to have a second stack for when this one runs out. It is very powerful. You know, to be perfectly honest, the water is almost always going to be better than the laudanum. It's only in the very specific situation of somebody getting horror on them. Do you care about the laudanum? And honestly, it just doesn't happen all that much. Supplies this way, if you can make it. Here go the wheels again. All right, a little bit more of that corpse removal powder, which we definitely don't need. I like the big ominous windmills. Perhaps I left windmills. this for you. Perhaps you left it for yourself. Perhaps it is not here at all. Wow, that's a lot of stuff. A bunch of chalk dust that we probably don't need. Corrupting cleaver we definitely don't need. This is just like a lot of garbage items. Your coach is laden. You can carry no more. Yeah, toss some chalk dust. Toss some pouch of lie. Yeah, we'll start there. Also, we have so much loathing. All right, everything is building up, just like all of the damage, all of the suffering, all of the madness. I'm actually very worried about our long-term survival prospects here. Hey, folks. Let us hope their desperation can be eased. That would be cool. It would be cool if that could happen. Uh, Stagecoach items I'm not so excited about. Our flame is at 51. So I don't want the food at all, but 30 flame is exciting. Obviously, scouting is zero value. I guess I'd prefer to take this, though, over the other... Yeah, because at least it doesn't cost us anything. The little bit of a bummer is that these two um, give each other a little bit of relationship, whereas this doesn't. But I think I'd rather just hold on to the currency... Yeah, okay, apparently I need to look ahead. Reliable information brings accurate insight, after all. Probably. Sometimes. Wheels askew, coach limping. Be prudent. I mean, listen, I literally don't get to make choices. I'm just doing I'm just going forward. Is this another watchtower? Was there a second watchtower on my route? Don't suppose that could, like, actually give me a bunch of light or something? <laughs> Convert it into a lighthouse? Those are the same thing, right? This has actually turned out to be a terrible choice to go to that lighthouse, and I'm pretty bummed out about it. I do feel like there should probably be a little bit more um, interaction in the paths. Like, the game should probably make some effort to make sure that paths like this don't spawn. These folk have kept their honor. Where you just don't get any choices, because that's a bummer. Uh, in items, I mean, those could be valuable. We're back down to 63 light. And once again, we have, like, an obviously best action that doesn't give any relationship. Yeah, let's do that. Leave items. I do not want your slime molds, friends. Okay, we have a couple of spaces open. Hopefully we're just going to pick up currency and not like garbage items here. Look ahead. A place to reflect, remember, and reconcile. Okay, we finally got a battle. Enemies here are infectious. Okay, so it doesn't actually add anything to their attacks, but it makes them, if they cause a, a status effect, it has extra duration. That's fine. 
Uh, there's nothing I can do to make him likely to miss or anything. Yeah, so I guess we just work on the other ones. Wow. On to the next. That really worked. Okay, that's a bummer. <laughs> There's a lot of really good work going on here. Yeah. Let's just strip the charges. Incremental. But deadly all the same. Hell yeah, rat skull. Uh, let's go ahead and pull this nerd forward. He's got pretty good move resist, actually. How much fire is that? Not much. All right. Yeah, let's step you up here. You are going to be a lot more useful to us up here. Do I also want to blind him? You know what? Well, damn. Never mind. Shit. He only has a 40% debuff resist. That's just bad luck, I guess. Time to falter. Okay, that bleed's not so bad. I think we can just burn through him. Rad, awesome. Good, good work. Hey, we actually get to cast Malediction. And then he... Empowered. Emboldened. And then he resists every debuff forever. Actually, let's let's use the blade here. Okay, annoying more than anything. The one pleasant in the extreme. This work is noble and necessary. We're coming out of this with like no mastery. Not to mention a universe of loathing. I'm gonna keep pushing Bonnie under the same logic as before. Chapter four. Burnt offering. An accident. But surely there was time to contain the flames. An ember jumped from the stove, did it? Okay. Uh, smother the fire would seem to be wise. Nope, that's not what she's looking for at all, in fact. Yeah, okay, we all knew how this was going. Flames leap dangerously. I'd say I kind of like the idea, though, of this, like, them making you do it. That's actually really interesting. It adds, um... You know, there's always an element to... Like these stories of creeping, creeping madness. And I do think this kind of stuff is a lot less Lovecraft and a lot more like Poe. Um, whereas that there, there is that like, you know, that that element of agency that like, why? Why was I driven to do it? Who can say? The were alight. 
There was no stopping it now. And I like them putting you in the seat and making you do it. Uh, so... Interesting. So from the front rows, move back one, try to set the front two people on fire, and maybe combo token them? Hold on, I'm actually really curious what the upgraded version of that is. Uh, a considerable amount of fire and a slightly higher chance of the combo token. I guess that's fine. Right, we're going to an Oblivion's Ingress, which is probably for the best. Shall we fight them, or shall we really fight them? Yeah, it feels like we should fight them. That's my opinion. Oh, these enemies are hail, are they? Okay, resistance is not bonus HP, which was what I was afraid it might be. Uh, I'm going to go for the Herald first, I guess. We're not going to be able to kill the altar before it gets its turn. Okay. Do I just start a fire up here? Or am I better off, like, smoke screening? You know what? I am going to smoke screen. Didn't get the vulnerability, sadly. Let us hope to finish this quickly. Alright, has got that fancy footwork. Uh let's I guess just hit the one that doesn't have the token. Bonnie, take advantage of your own token. Yeah, even with the bonus, this thing still really doesn't have that much um, fire resist. The Hell yeah. Strength dwindles. Well, I seriously doubt I'm going to get a kill here. I just have to work through it. Yeesh. Come on, blind. Hell yeah. Good work, blind. Um, you know what? Let's just grab your attention. Beautiful. I'm very much trusting Bonnie to deal with this. Okay, good, good, good. And then, like... I'm just gonna strip all of your defense charges? Nope, I'm gonna get fully resisted. Could have been a lot worse. Yeah, Dismas like very rarely gets to go first, despite having our highest speed. It is a bummer. A simple variable, easily resolved. Uh, I guess as long as you're going to stand back there. That feels pretty solid. Empowered. Emboldened. Yeah, it does feel like it's basically always Bonnie first. Alright, how 
How much HP do you have? Eight? Uh, I mean, there's no reason to... Yeah, there's no reason to, like, try to do a duelist advance or anything. And then, sadly, Alhazred can't actually deal damage to this thing. Uh, I don't know the vulnerability hex really makes any sense here, but... It's the thing we're allowed to do. Alright. Straight through that death blow. Another impediment. Cleared with impunity. We are the flame. Burning brightly for all the world to see. Okay, this one's a little less exciting. Um, I don't think we want to pick this up. Okay, my choices are only take all or leave all, I guess. That's fine. We can discard stuff on the other side. Festers. Wait, the loathing festers. Wasn't I supposed to lose a point of loathing? Well, whatever. Looks like we managed to make it through without, uh, without too much trouble here. I will say, it seems like the um, getting the third point of armor and uh, wheels on your uh, on your wagon seems very important. Hey, look, it's a very similar fight. Do I want to just... I mean, Abyssal Artillery does not feel super great here. It gets us the damage boost, at least. But I'm wondering if I should... Vulnerability Hex... Yeah. I'm going to try to set up the, uh, the Vulnerable now, just to prevent this thing from making itself borderline invulnerable. Alright. Let us be done with it. is no time to falter. Ow. Okay, that's a bummer. Uh, you have no death blow resist, so I guess we'll just work on you. Yeah. Stupendous. That was pretty stupendous. Oh, wait, I thought... Okay, well, I left that thing alive for an extra turn when I didn't really need to. It is pretty cool that we're actually getting to use Malediction. A wash in turmoil. Ouch, damn. Dismas is getting very fucked up very badly. Uh, let's just solve that problem. Hmm, am I better off, like, smoke bombing? Maybe. There we go. Don't want to spend the token. I might just, honestly, maybe we just bolster Dismas. Man's looking a little rough. This thing only has six speed. Okay. Wow. All right. You get to multi-attack don't think I care for that. Let's just get you off death's door for sure. And then maybe we just want to focus up here. Yeah, let's try to burn this thing down. 
Although you almost certainly need to just do a reconstruction. Um... Okay, that's that's enough to get you like probably off of uh, off of immediate chance to die. All right, hopefully you will just burn to death on your next turn. That's not a big deal. Do we... Mm, do I just want to do Abyssal Artillery and hope for the combo token? Honestly, that might be the better way to go here. Or... Eh, I should reconstruct. Yeah, okay, that's pretty good. Okay, resisted everything else, sadly. But at least we get to do this. Nine. Nine damage. What the fuck is that? All right, let's uh, maybe step it up a little bit. Collaboration confers advantage. Uh, I might. Do I want to just change my defense target? You know, let's let's do a bolster. We can make Dismas's life a little bit easier here. Alright, very good work from the vulnerability tokens. Are you under a third? No, you are not. So I won't be able to heal you with, uh, with Alhazred anyway. We may as well just go for the kill. If we can get it. Okay, that one was a little bit of a nightmare. Amidst the spoils, an artifact of unparalleled power. Okay, yeah, that's that's pretty solid. The loathing festers. Yeah, it loves doing that. All right, I don't need this, and I don't need some of this laudanum. Yeah, it's probably some of this laudanum. All right, and on to the end we go. This could have gone better, for sure. Lower your guard. Soften your gaze. It is safe here. Fisher Folk Slayer, probably not actually uh, useful. Pathfinder, also probably not actually useful at this point. Martyr, maybe. Maybe Martyr will be useful. All right. So, health and stress-wise, we're doing quite well. Pretty good place for relationships, generally. Dismas and Alhazred could, uh, could maybe have a little bit of a, a thing fixed up, but yeah, Precious overall I think we're doing well. Remind us of a time before the end. So... I mean, just like banking resistances. I don't know what we're going to be up against in this next uh, this next area. So maybe we 
just stack up some debuff resist on our people. Oh, I'm not allowed to buy anymore because I I feel like they should let you exceed the thing at the at the inn as long as you get back under the number before you leave. But okay. Uh Bonnie. Bleed resist. Dismas. Uh actually, Alhazred, bleed resist. And then we can do a little bit more. Ease the rigors of the road. So everybody except Barristan gets that resist. Bonnie's max HP is very poor, and I feel like we should try to fix that. Do we have a thing for that? We have a plus 10. I do believe that is the best we're going to be able to do. After all the slime molds I threw away. Ugh. All right, well, 19's gonna have to do. I mean, is it worth dropping? The plus 50% damage is very good. But I don't know, maybe it is worth um, switching out. Because she really is very low on, <laughs> on health. It's, it's bad. All right, this. I don't think we need, we might, we might use the whiskey flasks. A bit of comfort on the road to damnation. May as well, right? Uh, Alhazred, what if you didn't catch fire? And then it's just, it's just Dismas and Alhazred that we want to, yeah. Oh, he's too resolute. Hold on. Then... Yeah, okay, Dismas and Bonnie could use a boost, I guess. Also resolute. I forgot about that. Oh, well, it's just, uh, it's just relics. It's not a terribly important currency overall. Uh, somebody should get this plus 20% HP thing. Yeah, your trinkets are really important. Your murder weapon's not really doing anything most of the time. Yeah, it's a good idea. It's just not, it's just not working. This, I think, is still worth having. But maybe we switch out the footman's grog. I'm gonna, okay. Well, at this point... I was going to say, like, just put the murder weapon on him, but at this point, we probably just unequip it, honestly. Like, what are we going to fight that isn't a boss, right? And I think with that, we are good to go. I have no idea if I think Blight or Bleed is going to be more... I guess I'll, I'll guess Bleed. And then we just have some mastery, right? I guess we have the Wainwright. Planning and mindfulness, as vital to survival as sharpened steel. I don't think the wagon's gonna be in any danger of um. Prepared and refurbished, ready for the leagues ahead. Just in case, just in case. I'm a little bummed out. I didn't realize we weren't quite at enough. I definitely would have prioritized the armor. All right, and then of three of these. So, I think we've upgraded everything she needs upgraded. For Dismas. Yeah, this one really does not get... It does not get much better when you upgrade it. Do I want to upgrade Wicked Slice just to have it on hand? Probably not. Take aim is pretty good.
What does Malediction become if you upgrade it? Oh, okay, it reduces their the likelihood that the target will resist the debuffs. It's really not much of an upgrade. Um, you know, we use the pulse sometimes. I guess I'll take the upgrade on Malediction. I think we're like pretty short on stuff that we would actually want to use. Yeah, you know, we're doing Defender sometimes. I'm going to unequip Rampart, probably, and equip Bellow. Or unequip Hold the Line and equip Bellow. I'm not actually using Hold the Line at all, and we might use Bellow. All right, all and with that, all that's left the is the mountain. mountain. And we're only like a half an hour into the episode. I guess let's just go. Do we want to swap these? Chance to produce contraption items. I haven't noticed it doing that. I guess I don't know what's a contraption item, though. Okay, that's a contraption. That's a concoction. Hmm. So, woven items. Everybody likes flapjacks. Fuck it. Reconfigure. Meet each challenge on its own terms. And the terms for meeting this challenge on are flapjacks. The warmth of better days gone now and tuned in ice 19 health is really scary but her damage output you know five relationships okay aspiration unites the hopeful hopeful's fine we got the most common abilities that's really nice respectful Tried is more exciting tested. a bond to be counted on okay so these are bad. Wicked Slice is not so bad, but those are bad. That was a bad draw there. This one's solid, like that. They're still Why amorous. Still beats. Desire will Ooh, never die. That rules. We're gonna use Abyssal Artillery a fair amount, I think. And okay. All right, we have a, a wide variety of bonuses here. Most of these are not particularly powerful, though. At least Barristan is still going to be super, super tough. At last, the Great Ziggurat. Temples of failure and regret. I'm really bummed out that I didn't repair the last point of armor. I should have. I should have actually counted. I just assumed I would have enough. Reality comes asunder before our eyes. All right, let's light them up. Is that a vulnerability for everyone? No, not everyone. That said, I think we can still get there. Uh, you can't actually attack him in any way, but you sure can light this dude up. No time to falter. Ow. Crit me on the first turn. I might just... Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and de-stress you some now there, friend. Calculated generosity. But a welcome one nonetheless. That's really annoying. That is really annoying. 
Alright, I can't actually harm you, so we just keep it up. Malaise. Measured and steady. Wow. Get that corpse for 33 damage. Uh, and I guess we just... Oh, I forgot to do the switch. Well, we will. Alright, I think we should be able to take this apart here. So the question now is, do I spend the last spring water and just put Dismas... Yeah, let's just do this so that we can put something else in Dismas's hand. And wanes. Yeah, it'd be cool if he was weakening and waning just like a little bit more. Uh, I guess I can't actually hit him, but I can do this. Maybe I'll just burn to death. Hooray! Overcome even the greatest of threats. Alright, let's take a moment here and fix some Retrieve. things about the party. Until the next test is put before you. First things first, Dismas needs a new combat item. It's probably going to be the other laudanum. Or, like, more smoke bombs. Honestly, that, um, that Tinker's Bench just pumping out smoke bombs is not terrible. So we already have two items for compensating with stress. I think it is going to be more smoke bombs. And Sergeant... You are losing hold the line, gaining bellow. Okay. Gosh, the torch is already really low. Hold on a second. Maybe I wanna... Yeah, like the, the free chance of blinding enemies. Well, but I'd rather just have this, which gives you blind straight up. And this also gives us death blow resist though. Let's do this to make sure we can stay lit. Behold, the source of the stain. Gateway to incomprehensible emptiness. This seems uh, more menacing than last time we were here, I think. The seething sigh. Stertorous avatar of ill-concealed rage. Hmm... Increases damage and uh, stress dealt by Sundering Exhalation, but removed if sufficient damage is taken. Okay. Well, let's see about that. So there's a couple of lungs. Um, I guess let's just... I could Vulnerability Hex this thing and we could just really have at it. Yeah. Let's see about that. Go ahead and light things up. We'll just do that every round. Well done. And then that buffs up Bonnie, so Bonnie can really hit it. Writ large. 43 is a pretty good start, y'all. We can just, like, slow all of them. That doesn't feel like a great play. I think we just smash. You don't need your lungs. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Uh, he had that vulnerability on him. I was a little worried. All right, same deal. So it's got it's got a little marking on the bar that I assume is the point where the damage is enough. But without that number, without that marking having a number on it as well, it does feel a little it's a little bit guess and check here. A breakthrough. Okay, one hit was sufficient. But why stop, I ask you? Ooh, combo combo tokens on both. Pretty exciting. Do we wanna... Yeah, I think I'm just gonna start the burn then, if we got the combo token. 
And we got the other thing under control already. Ooh, that's ugly. Uh... So this will de-stress out Hazard a little bit. Yeah, this is worth doing. That's a pretty cool animation. Alright, I am on fire just the tiniest bit. Let's do one more of these. Rascal's doing some okay work. <laughs> There's there is some decent stuff going on here. Can't really do much about the blind. I could try to throw up a smoke screen. I don't know the I'm assuming the blind would be would affect this though. I'm just gonna take the swing and hope. Yeah, alright. Darkness seems too much. Let's fuck this shit up. Um, I think a malediction actually is a very good uh, fit for this situation. Victory supposes strategy. Actually, I just Press on. hold on. I just realized the thing was, yeah, it has 200 resist of everything. Never mind. That's not actually that helpful. Uh, can't remove blind with bolster even if it was off cooldown. I'll just block, I guess. Yeah, we hit the fire on the middle section, so I was just like, oh, okay, it can be affected, and I didn't even really look at the numbers. Alright, it's slightly slower going than I would have liked. Please just land the hit. Good, 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 good. And Dismas is almost at a level of health where we can heal him. Do I just protect him again? I definitely don't want to spend this vulnerable token. with Not with this attack. Yeah, maybe I just... Oh, okay. Little little hiccup in the animation there made me nervous. Just keep giving him the buff. Okay, it's not too much fire. Ooh, shallow breath over there that this time. All right, I can change up the uh, the strat. That's fine. I mean, it's not really that different. Thirty-nine. It really does suck how like how low we have to let everybody get before we're allowed to heal. At least doing this will give Bonnie a little bit of HP back. Oh dear. Okay. Uh, so first things first. A simple kindness. And then actually, I think we um <laughs> maybe need to block for her. Probably a good idea. I, I love that the rat skull has been triggering every single round well this battle. Done. Dismas is just consistently on top of it. Okay, we finally can attempt to heal. All right, this is a little, it buys her a second. That's one turn worth of burning. Something medicinal might have been a good idea to bring. We're definitely over-prepared for, for stress.
Do I want to... I think we kind of have to keep the defender rolling. Okay, blind finally wore off of uh, Barristan, so I guess we could do some attacking. Exhaustion takes hold. I am feeling a little exhausted. <laughs> it's been a long battle already. All right, please just land a big one. Good, good, good. Okay, I got a little nervous there, but 12 was sufficient. And we're getting close. God. We're having a lot of trouble dealing with we the blinds. We rely only upon each other. Let's try to give you a little bit more room to work. All right. Don't know what that would have done, but probably would have been really bad. Ooh, 10. Okay, 10 is sufficient. All right, this time we are actually guaranteed to hit. And this turn, do we just... Oh, no, that's still 16 damage. I'm not going to... I'm not going to make that happen. Let's just keep buffing Dismas. Do I want a vulnerability hex? I kind of want to just... Yeah. Hoping for the uh, the combo chance, but also the little bit of healing is nice. Ouch. Dismas is going to bring down this long in the time it took Bonnie to just finish this one off. Oh, come on, Bonnie. Ouch. Reconstruct self. Okay, not bad, not bad. Uh, here, it is definitely worth just taking the swing. It's a long fight, but I feel like all we gotta do is just maintain control, right? Now see, how come I'm not getting a rat skull? We're, the rat skull's not always firing, and I'm not 100% clear on why. Do you wanna just start working the body, or is it better to... You know what? Oh, I can't smoke screen that thing. Well. Let's, let's smoke screen the main body then. Yeah, actually only Dismas and Alhazred can hit that. Uh, let's... I guess just cover. Okay. Yeah, all that dodge is really doing some fantastic work. All right, use your own combo token. Damn, it resisted. Twelve health left. I may as well just hit it, right? All right, well, it's going down. I don't know what she's panicking about. I'm a little worried about her position, though.
Okay, not too bad, not too bad. Obviously, you know what we're going to do here. And then I wonder if there will be a change in the way the fight works or if we've just, you know, got to the easy part now. Keep the shield up on you. That's unfortunate. Good news is with this thing being only like half resistant to fire, is the key. we should be able to build up a pretty reasonable. Yeah, I'm going to guard her again and we're going to heal Dismiss. We should be able to build up a pretty reasonable stack of damage. Beautiful. Okay, she's going to need some love real soon. Okay, I guess this is slightly more damage. Oh, that's right, it is It is also placing the dodge on Barristan, so we do need to keep doing that one. It's worth a try. Four entire HP. give her a little bit more of a push and then she is still only on 8 HP like it, yeah we definitely still keep blocking for her Ugh, this thing is doing an annoyingly competent job of keeping my damage dealers sort of like doing their jobs very slowly. Just a hard miss on the vulnerability hex. Hold fast. For who knows what lurks in the beyond. This is a long fight. This is I can I can definitely see a party that has less sustain having a lot of problems here just getting worn down over time. More bleed. Tick, tick, tick. Ooh. They have given their last. The thing is, if Bonnie dies, I don't think it actually does necessarily break us. It would not be great. It would slow down the damage even more. An interminable conflict. I mean, this really sucks. There's just, there's no way to disregard that. I guess, okay. A brilliant I can be doing slices to power up Bonnie instead of, um, instead of pistol shots to, wow, that was a bummer. Uh, instead of pistol shots to give Barristan dodge. I don't know. Uh, why do you have to keep getting bloodthirsty? Alright, maybe we are just gonna die. Cooperation is the key. And there's a good chance you die anyway. Yeah. I think we're just gonna get worn down here, because... It did such a good job of blinding the most important people over and over again for so many turns. 
Do we have anything left that gives health? We don't. We have no way of, of saving him. Alright, do this. Power up Bonnie. Bonnie gets in there and hits for 11 entire damage. Okay. We live. No reason not to throw the last one of those. Please hit for, like, a real amount. Uh. Okay. Don't know what that was. It was new, though. Be real bad if we lost all Hazred. Ugh, so of course it hits with an attack that hits them both. So the thing I just did doesn't matter at all. Okay, it did not defend itself this turn though, so hopefully between the two of our damage dealers we can get in for like a real amount. Okay. Another another narrow survival at Death's Door. Critical yield for four. That's like a fake amount. Let's hit you with that laudanum. De-stress as best we can. I don't understand how she's only doing 11 damage with a damage buff. Definitely think we're bolstering here to prevent the uh, the stress out. Once again, teetering on that terrible. Wow. Okay. Just every debuff. Well. Also, it is trying to kill the torch. Yeah, this thing still has 88 health left. This conflict is fucking interminable. Stupendous. <sighs> the path of exculpation. Need not be a lonely one. Are you sure? It feels like it might need to be. It feels like it might need be. Um. Right? Like, yeah, if all the debuffs stick, that's actually really powerful. Collaboration confers and then... I think we need to keep playing defense for obvious reasons. It's going to have a negative effect on their relationship, but I don't think that can matter at this point. Okay, Rat Skull's up. So... It's not immune to stun. The stun might actually land. Let's see. Okay, we got a stun. That is going to help. That buys us some time. Might as well keep that up. And then, like, I can't smoke screen again, but you're not going to hit with an attack. Probably. I guess there's not really anything else to do. And this at least de-stresses Barristan. Okay, she got there. Oof. All right. Uh, my man did not heal himself for very much. Yeah, sorry, Bonnie. I think we just gotta... Okay. Extinguished. She can run no further. Yeah, not ideal, but we didn't really have a choice, I don't think. Let's see, I should have gotten Rat Skull here, right? Excellent work. Oh, we finally hit the dreaded zero. Okay, well, at least the, the boss is attacking the tombstone now.
Gives me a little bit of time. Curse your fucking infinite shield. Do I just start, like... Yeah, I'm gonna deal some damage, I guess. If I do this, it'll just de-stress Barristan. Try to get that combo token? Nope. Okay. We need to get, like... We need to get actual attacks in whenever it allows me to. Um, it has 9 HP. Barristan is super weakened, though. I think I'm best off just continuing to buff, ba buff Dismas here. Okay. Ugly, ugly, ugly. I hate that this thing just gets block plus for free every fucking turn. Okay, we're close. We're close. How much death blow? We can rely only upon oh. each other. Okay, that's that's a cool buff. It has 33 death blow resist. You literally can't deal the four damage necessary to kill it. Ah. Uh, and you'll probably miss when you attack anyway. So go ahead and just do this again. And I'm gonna go for the reconstruction, I think. Two zeros, okay. Dying light indeed. Ugh, and Dismas gets blinded and gets a combo token and yeah, everything goes everything goes awry. Well, he still makes the shot though. And at this point we gotta just hit it, right? Your fault in burying your furies. But in thinking they would accept such a fate. Is that what that was? I gotta be honest with you, I don't think they're doing a good job necessarily, uh has been halted. For a time. That's not too bad. I don't think they're doing a great job necessarily of connecting the narrative to the mechanics on that one. Did that feel like purging resentment? I don't I guess I felt pretty resentful. Oh, okay. You know what? That right there is, uh, that's what we're going to call it there. That's, that's going to be it for us for today. Thank you all so much for watching. That got a little terrifying, but we managed to narrowly make it through. And I guess on to the third contract, the, the third, um, whatever, the third nightmare. Uh, I imagine it's just going to get even worse from here, but we're going to earn some new characters. We're going to unlock some stuff and hopefully we're going to get even luckier than we did this time. To be clear, even though I'm like a little frustrated about the pair of zero heals toward the end, I think we did get quite lucky overall because we had a lot of death blow resists. I don't even know what uh, Alhazred's percentage is supposed to be, but it feels to me like that is not the intended the thing we saw there is probably not expected value. Anyway, come back next time for a new nightmare and we'll see you then.